Hey there, it's Daniel from thegoodax.com where you can get free Google Docs templates and guides. Today we will quickly insert a video into the Google Doc. We're really used to presenting data by means of video in the 21st century. And of course, Google Slides allow you to insert a video into your presentation. Here we do that and overview the features of this function. To insert a video into Google Slides, on a particular slide, we naturally go to Insert Item on the toolbar and press in it. Down to the fourth Video Item. And here, our options are to search for a video on YouTube straight from this search field like you normally do on YouTube. Then, you can paste a direct link to the video right here. Or select one from your Google Drive, press in it meaning the video has to be pre-uploaded to your drive beforehand. And when you're in this menu, it will show you all videos that you have on your drive, no matter what folder it is located in. It will just show you all results. Or you search it by its name. Here is mine, a single video I have on my drive in the main folder, though you can also get it from shared drives, shared with me, and recent files that you have used earlier. I click on the video and then press select at the bottom of the window. Here it is inserted above everything on the slide. And concerning its placement on the dock, that is no different from how you do it with images. You can click hold it and move it over the working area. You can expand it by pulling either edge of the figure and decrease it with the same technique. Also, as you can see, when the element is highlighted, there's this button in a corner with a link in it that leads directly to the file on the drive if you press it. Back to the presentation. And here is how you insert a video into Google Sites. Similar to images, you have some format options. It either appears just when you have dropped the video onto the dock, or you can select the element. And here in the toolbar on top, you can create the border for the element. Increase its weight and change the border dash. But then there's advanced format options here on the right. We press it and that opens the format menu on the right. What's awesome here is that first up you can preview your video. And this option here is exactly to let you set which part of the video you want to show in the presentation when you select the video and dismiss other parts of it. This instrument allows you to set the start and end points here, which will make only this part of the video be played on the demonstration. Let me show you. I will just set the end point at 3 seconds. And then I will click on the play button in the middle of the element. So basically, it made the video stop at the third second, and you can set any start and end points or you can set these points by pressing anywhere on the timeline. And below the field for the start point, press Use Current Time. It will put the position here. And the same concerning the end point, where we press anywhere on a timeline again. But then, use Current Time below the End At field, which is a really nice feature, and now you know how to use it. Concerning other elements on the format menu, there's size and rotation, which, as usual, allows you to manually adjust the dimensions of the element centimeter by centimeter and change its scale. On the next menu item, you can adjust the figure position more finely on an XY axis. And the last item is the drop shadow option, which is adjustable with these sliders basically making the object cast a shadow to make it look deeper and stand out from other elements, which is commonly used with text, word art, and images. And I'd like to mention the fact that you can animate the video just like all other objects. But with that difference that you can make the video start automatically when you switch to a slide with it, which can really come in handy. And to delete the video, select it, and then press backspace or delete button. 
hundreds more guides and a lot of free Google Docs templates on the goodax.com following the link below the video. Like to help share our videos to more people and subscribe to see more guides? I hope we helped you. Thank you for watching.